It's Night Law. It is Monday and I'm very dressed down today, but I'm heading to dinner with one of my family members, well, with probably a bunch of my family members. Um, and I took off a bit early just so I could drive out to the end of the road and catch Ken. Um, I forgot how many miles the road is here from end to end. But I think it only took me and my cousin like 47 minutes or something like that to drive all of Ketchikan, which was fun to do one night. Um, so I think that's about it. It's really pretty out today. It, I think it rained a bit, yeah, it rained a bit last night and during the day today. Now it's starting to get sunny out. I don't like filming while I'm driving, so I can't show you, but maybe I'll figure out how to set up a tripod or something like that. Um, or set up a tripod while I'm driving so it won't distract me, I'm not sure, but, um, nothing too exciting today, just, um, work more, and, or finish up tying loose ends for work, and then, um, and then I have to start on my own projects, so, I'm excited about that, uh, I think that's about it. Night law, it is Tuesday, and today I am organizing and minimizing, I'm going through all my shoes, and I'm going through, and the ones I don't really wear that often, I'm going to go and donate them or give them to someone. Um, these are such a good idea, and they're so comfortable, but they don't go with any of my outfits or my personality, so I'm going to get rid of them. Um, I don't have as many shoes as I used to, and it's just, it feels like a work in progress, because I feel like I'm getting down to the shoes that I actually wear every day. The shoes I wear almost every day are these, these shoes. They're really cute and they're like really durable and they're Crocs. <laughs> so um, I'm going to be keeping these. But I have like a couple pairs of heels that I never wear and both of them are really ugly. I just keep them because they can, they're like easy and comfortable to wear and I never feel good in them. Um, I'm going to keep these pair that I never wear because I really do want to get more comfortable walking in heels. But um, I haven't gotten around to it yet, but I think I will the more I minimize. Or maybe next month I'll end up throwing those out or donating those or something. So um, I'm pretty happy with my closet, like with all the clothes, but I think I might go through that and see if I have a couple things I, that are, might be too small or something that I just don't wear or feel comfortable in. So I think that's about it. It's Tuesday. I haven't gone out too much today. I have Haida language class later on and um, I've been just working on the computer, figuring out how to set up a website and then following up on some Haida language gathering stuff. And my hair looks really fuzzy. <laughs> but um, that's about it. House Tenshi I've been thinking too much. Class. So I'm making my inspiration board, and that's a quote. Any experience is a good ex is as good as you make it. And then I'm gonna use this board to put all the fonts and colors that I do for all the different social media things I've run. So this is Haida Language Learners, and I decided yesterday these will be the colors for Haida Language Learners. And then I have a few other pages and groups that I want to start doing colors and fonts and um, making a bit more organized. So, yeah, that's my, that's my Wednesday. I think that's about it. Nothing else too exciting. Yay. It's night law, it is Thursday and I'm, I forgot where I'm at, but it'll be in another video. Um, today I'm driving around Elfie, he just came back from Atlacatla from a language training and um, we went and visited some of his, his, his family members, Kevin Clevenger and um, Wayne Hootson and um, the videos you'll see next are going to be of that, so yay! Take a break from computer time, and it's so pretty outside. You'll see some otter photos and videos too. Rainforest Sanctuary with Kevin and Elfie and it's Wayne. Like, uh... yeah. And um, Kevin is working on a totem with Wayne. Houston. Houston. 
Houston. Houston. <laughs> Houston kicking sign. Oh. My, name, my name is Wayne Houston, and what I'm doing here is carving a 40-foot pole. It's all about a cannibal giant called Buttonish. And uh, right now it's just the very beginning. And uh, this is called this is called a whip pad. So it's what I use to round things out and to get it all done. So I can start drawing and give them eyes and big proboscis. Evil looking guy. A really cool story. In, uh, in about 10 months, I'll be done with the project. Then you can come back and take a photo of it. Yeah, do that. Uh, so, uh, Deutschland, is that his name? Yes. yes.